Party is every day, every minute of the day, um, and the music is on all the time, 24 hours a day. And when it's off, we're we're not in the area, basically. And it's about coming together of of people from all backgrounds, all ages, dogs, children, grandparents, etc., etc., coming together in this one communal space uh, where the music is the food. and leave their jobs and just pack up and run away from home and come and join Spiral Tribe, you know, like a, joining a circus, you know, and uh, contribute whatever skills, talents uh, they might have and, and, and love it. And that's why it's grown so big and the amount of people actually on the road is quite contagious, the way that kind of uh, creative vibe is uh, very, very strong and comes across. So I think, you know, that's, uh, that's what sets us apart from the straightforward commercial nightclub run-of-the-mill kind of event, which is just sort of music and leisure industry entertainment. I mean, it doesn't go any further than that. Instructions to the officers were to arrest the people. Police moved in around 8 o'clock last night. Instructions to the officers were to arrest the people to prevent a breach of the peace. Serious breach of the peace. Most rhythmic based music has always been called the devil's music. They've always told you to keep away from that rock and roll music, that voodoo music, that didgeridoo music, whatever you want to call it. But the, the key thing is that all these forms of music trance you. Now, whatever it is about it, whether that's the element that they're worried about, something about this music the authorities have never liked, you know, because it's driver. World traveler, adventurer. World traveler, adventurer. If you look at Castle Morton, it just seems that there was a complete irreverence to the people who lived in the area. And of course, it, it screwed the whole thing up for all the other outfits that wanted to be on the free festival scene and wanted to perpetuate the free festival scene, which I think is a very valuable thing to do. just a reactionary kick lash back against the society. I mean, if we don't like things about our society, you know, we don't go out and just go and sort of uh, petrol bomb the place, you know, we don't do that at all. I mean, what does that achieve? What we actually do is it's techno-terrorism. That is, I think, where we're different, is that we take a very creative and positive approach um, to what may be bad in society. You know, we're not confrontational, we're not violent, uh, uh, we're not just rejecting everything. What we're doing is we're actually um, changing what we feel is wrong. I think in the music, uh, what we do, and with the parties as well, is we point out maybe there are things wrong in society or things should be done a different way. Sparrow tribe might call themselves techno-terrorists, but um, I can't see it. If what they're saying is that through techno music, um, you can tune into world issues and change the world, I mean, show me how. I, I haven't seen any, any evidence of people that have gone to Spiral Tribe parties and then left thinking I'm going to conquer the world, I'm going to change everything for the better. We don't know what the future is. Mm. We don't have crystal balls. We just make it up as we go along and we yeah. just love it. Live in the moment. Of it. Yeah. Live in the moment and think positive. That's it. And that's the basic thing. Yeah. yeah, stop worrying, basically. Stop getting all sort of tangled up in the nostalgia of the past and stop worrying about ambitions and success and all these kind of uh, very strange ideas of what the future might hold for you. Just get on with now, because this is the important bit. You know, sort out the sound system, get the music on. That's what's important. Yeah.